This video is associated with the practical sheet at rugby school, making predictions and testing them. You should only look at this video when you have made your predictions. When you have made your predictions and you have decided whether a precipitate is going to form, look at this video and decide if your predictions match the experimental um, data obtained today. Experiment 1. Barium chloride and potassium sulfate. A few drops of colourless barium chloride and a few drops of colourless potassium sulphate. Experiment 2. Sodium chloride solution. A colourless solution once again. with potassium nitrate solution, also colourless. The next experiment, silver nitrate solution, kept in a brown bottle, but also a colourless solution. This is um, added to calcium chloride solution, a colourless solution as well. In number four, zinc sulphate is combined with barium chloride. In number five, sodium chloride is combined with potassium sulfate. In number six, copper to sulfate solution is combined with sodium chloride. In number seven, sodium carbonate solution is combined with calcium chloride. Again, both colourless solutions. In number eight, copper sulfate 
is combined with potassium nitrate. Potassium nitrate first, according to the instructions. And then copper sulfate. Number nine, we have zinc sulfate combined with sodium carbonate. And the last experiment, lead nitrate is combined with barium chloride. Barium chloride. It is important that you consider on each occasion whether any solid material has been produced in the solution. Number one. Number two. Number three. Number four. Number five. Number six. Number seven, number eight, number nine, and number ten. It's your job now to decide whether the experimental work has matched your predictions. <laughs>